Hi everybody, Justin Weber, Amazon Sound. Uh, I was going to share with you my newest projects and where I stand with them. And I got some advice from one of my close friends and it was fantastically good advice that is ultimately going to be a great decision, but means I'm building another set of speakers after this. So what we have here is the venerable, world famous, never duplicated uh, Altec 604 made by Great Plains Audio. And it is a wonderful, wonderful reproduction of, this, of the original Altec 604. Uh, and just an all around great speaker choice. So we went with the Altec 604 with the ferrite magnet, and there's a rhyme and reason for that, in that the ferrite magnet is significantly shorter than the Alnico, and there is some thinking that you get better uh, coherence uh, and time alignment by having the voice coils closest to each other, and the Alnico is like four inches longer. And we're gonna put that idea to the test because the next ones are probably gonna be Alnico to test it out. So we have the world famous Altec 604. As you guys have seen, I'm in the process of building a set of uh, Altec 612 cabinets, 612C cabinets to be more specific. I chose those because I don't really like tall speakers. I don't mind them wide, um, but I like them sort of 30 to 36 inches tall at the most. Um, I generally like them a little shorter, 30 inches is my preferred, 30 to 32 inches is my preferred height. And, you know, I like them wide. So the 612 was my perfect choice for that. And the 612 cabinet that I chose accommodates the original style crossovers. Great Plains Audio uh, furnished us these crossover or this crossover. This is one complete unit. And the L pads will be in the front, which will let me fiddle and adjust to my heart's content super easily and we'll see how the original sounding crossover uh, compares to some new thinking so what this is is new thinking my very very good friend Al Klappenberger of ALK Engineering uh, was kind enough to design for me a brand new crossover for an Altec 604 uh, there are some new or newer style crossovers for the Altec uh, but this is some original thinking that is specific to OWLs. So it's a, a Linkowitz Riley network. Uh, so it's a fourth order for both the low pass and for the high frequency. Uh, your high frequency is adjustable with an auto former, and it's pretty, pretty special, truth be told. And uh, we're gonna put it to the test. So my friend, uh, Jeremiah Griffith, uh, uh, Agartha Audio, you know, I'm talking about this whole plan. Cabinets are in finishing as we speak. I actually get them tomorrow night. Uh, we're doing lacquer uh, on them right now. They're getting a beautiful rosewood veneer. And I was talking about original crossover, original style 604, and, you know, then comparing it to a new crossover, a new thinking for crossover technology. And he basically suggested that, you know, the best way to do this is not to listen to both crossovers and make a determination, but to implement something I have on the back shelf that I had, wasn't intending to use, which is I have a custom cabinet that we designed. And so what we're gonna do is Altec 604, Great Plains crossover, Altec 612 cabinet, hear that out, keep it as it's in, you know, at, design in its entirety and we'll have a, a reference point to the original and then what we're going to do is Amson Sound Custom Cabinet which is a little bit smaller and uh, tuned a little differently with ALK's crossover and a brand new Altec 604 to pair with it and so we're going to have both eventually side by side and be able to hear and compare and contrast the differences and hopefully they're Hopefully they're remarkable, because then what we have to figure out is, was it the cabinet that did it or the crossover? Because we're going to try to keep the driver uh, consistent. But yep, aside from our amplifiers, which we love and work on, uh, these are the kinds of things that we do in the middle of the night. Keeps us up and makes us, gives us something to think about. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoy. Uh, when the cabinets come in, we'll update you.
Thank you so much.